Svensson is a good dead ball man too. Tobias Lindelof wants of Everton. is standing over the ball, but Larson looks the odds-on favourite. It's Henrik Larson. <laughs> and back by Bill Helmsen. That's a little wild from Samuel and from Fearball, and very, very wild indeed from John. Overhead kick from Ibrahimovic. There was a scandalous challenge there by Avery John. Larson releasing Ibrahimovic. Only Larson for some board at the moment. Is that on Ibrahimovic? Cut into Larson. Whisker away from making a vital connection. Good. Edwards is coming to a good position. They've gone away a very good shot. Shaban had to hold on. Struck that really well, Carlos Edwards. Jungberg starting to drift now more and more in search of the ball. It's a good clip cross towards Larson! Electric football. Freddie Jungberg's cross beautifully floated. And a dramatic header from Henrik Larson. Fabulous play. Terrific ball by Lundberg. And Larson's run across the defender was brilliant there. Trying to be patient. Ibrahimovic on by Larson. It'll come for Wilhelmsen! It's a really good save by Shaka Hislop. Larson trying to play Wilhelmsen in. Headed back into the danger area by Linderot. Headed away by Gray. Seen to bomb by Ibrahimovic. And another good reaction stop from his lot. Gray panicked into a clearance by Youngberg. OK, Sam, let's get back to the action. We started the first half by speculating that the group could be about how many everybody else scores against Trinidad and Tobago. Well, the sum total so far is none. And they have acquitted themselves superbly. And here's Zlatan Ibrahimovic with Youngberg for company. Ibrahimovic goes tumbling and looking for a free kick. And there's problems here for Avery John. I think it could be a second yellow card. Slid in, got the ball, but he's off. Well, that changes everything. The referee from Singapore, Shamsui Maidi, has shown a red card within 30 seconds of the restart to Avery John, who has been rather rash with his tackles. I think he got the ball, but I think it was a dangerous tackle. Now a little bit of space here for Freddie Youngberg. Carlos Edwards again, outstanding. Defended really well, hasn't he, there? Two or three times in the last ten minutes. Eric Edmund with the cross throw, Ibrahimovic! Is it far away? an opportunity for Cornell Glenn. Oh, it's a great effort, and he turned the crossbar. From an impossible angle, facing impossible odds, Trinidad and Tobago almost took the lead. Incredible strike. We're sitting right behind that, and you're thinking, well, oh, he's not going to shoot from there, is he? Oh, he has. Goodness me. <laughs> Fantastic shot. It's one of those where the goalkeeper says, go on, then shoot. I'm all right. Cornell Glenn. Would have put the cat amongst the pigeons, wouldn't it? Alex Anderson with the cross. Ibrahimovic is free. Edwards lost him. Caught up with him eventually. Still Ibrahimovic. Oh, he handed off. Edwards there. Referee waves play on. Edwards got a flying arm in his face then. What a save by Shaka, though. I mean, I don't know if he knew too much about it, but good touch by Ibrahimovic. Oh, brilliant reflex save. An unsurprising change. And that Anders Svensson is going to be replaced by a forward. Marcus Elbeck. Aston Villa fans will remember him. Linderoff. And by Jungberg, here's Elbeck. Jungberg. Edmund. Elbeck! Straight at his lock. Number 16, Kelstrom has just agreed to move to Gerard Ullier's Lyon. Here's Larson. And now Elbeck. And no flag. Somehow Hislop keeps him out again. Ibrahimovic. Shaka Hislop. Hero. It's a good ball though from Kelstrom and Jonsson is arriving. And he's gone away from Gray. And he's turned it across the face of goal and Albeck couldn't reach it. Maybe Youngberg can still set something up though. Mistake by Carlos Evans. He got back and got the ball. Great tackle. What a recovery tackle that was. Larson. Kelstrom. A lot of space here. Rolled into Ibrahimovic, allowed to turn. 
Caught it well. And it flew over the crossbar into those supporters. They've done it. Trinidad and Tobago have held Sweden. A match to remember these opening stages by an unlikely encounter between two teams and contrasting cultures with a hot favourite and a wild outsider and nothing to separate them thanks to the brilliance of Shaka Heslop and the sheer pride of the men in red and England will have to play some to beat them on Thursday. Nil-nil here in Dortmund.